Hi, you're watching Kolsky Drones, welcome back. Today we're going to look at the Xiaomi 4K drone, six months after buying. Hi, welcome back to Kolsky Drones. So today's something a bit different. I want to do a revisit on the Xiaomi Mi 4K drone that I bought. I've had it six months now, and what I want to do is give you my impressions after six months. So I reviewed this when I first got it and loved it. And after numerous flights now, I just wanted to go over what I now think about it. So, when I first got this, I thought the drone was fantastic. My opinion hasn't changed. So, I've numerous flights on this. The battery charges as it should do every time. The return to home is amazing on this thing, and the camera quality is fantastic. It's never once let me down. I actually fly this as much as I fly my Phantom 4. I do alternate between the two, and I'm not saying it's as good as the Phantom 4. But what I am saying is, it's a fantastic drone, and underrated. You think after a few months I might have got some niggles on it where I was losing connection or the range might not have been as good. But none of that. I constantly get 1500 meter range on this thing, which is more than adequate for what I want it for. I have no issues with break up on the screen. The app is very, very nice. As you can see, there is no lag at all on the app. That's the gimbal moving, you can see. The gimbal's fantastic. It's great in wind. It really is a nice drone. And for 300, I think it's 330 on, on uh, Banggood at the minute to buy it new, but you can pick these things up second hand for £250. Don't get it confused with the 1080 version. This is the 4K version. The easiest way to tell it's got gold embellishment on the top. And it's got gold tips on the propellers. And it's got gold everywhere. There is a massive difference between this and the 1080. It's not just the camera. The 1080 drone was what they made first. It wasn't particularly good. This has been refined since then. I've only had to do one update on it and that was for no fly spaces. And you don't have to do that. I particularly do it, but you don't have to. And that's all I've had to do since I've got it. I've not had to do any updates on it. It doesn't constantly remind me to do one. I'm getting similar flight time to get to the Phantom 4. All in all, I have to say I absolutely love this thing. And as I say, it is underrated, because you don't see that many of them. But if you, watch, if you check for flight footage on YouTube, you won't find that many, because there doesn't seem to be that many about, or not in, certainly not in the UK. Maybe it tends to be more in Japan and China and places like that. But I cannot fault this. Everything works as it should. The controller feels amazing in your hands. At the end of the video, I'm going to put a link up to my previous... Um, video on this when I did my review on it. I'm not going to review it again. I just wanted to let you know that how, how I think about it after th six months of owning it. Because sometimes after six months you can think, mm, it's not right as good as I did when I first did my review. Um, but there's none of that. It really is fantastic. It flies like a dream. I, if you go on the internet you might find some people saying they've had issues with the batteries. I, I do not charge it on the stock charger, I must admit, I bought a multi-charger for it, which charges it slower and balances it better, and maybe that's why I've had no issues with my battery, but my battery's as good as it was when it was new. The flight time hasn't diminished at all, it really is that good. So this was just a quick video, just in case you haven't actually seen one of these before, but it's well worth looking at. So please check out my other video, I'm going to leave you with some flight footage that's been taken with the drone so you can see for yourself what the camera looks like. Have a fantastic day and thanks very much for watching.
Thanks very much for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed it, if you do please hit the like button and please do consider subscribing if you haven't already and hit the notification bell. Thanks for watching.